Great greetings, everyone. Nat Jam Edie here. And today, we are accepting the amazing time challenge of this first level. And remember, you can only do the time challenges with SpongeBob. Now, as you can see, well, actually, I'm not sure if you, well, you don't see it, you hear it. And I'm not sure how much you can hear it because I'm talking right now. But guess what? Is that they're not playing the slide music, they're playing the downtown bikini bottom music, and then when you hit that checkpoint, the slide music comes back. I've uh, never noticed that before. So I don't know why that happens. It's still, why do no why did my control why did my controls lock up? What the heck? What the heck? My controls locked up. That was terrible. They did not. Guys, I'm just not doing any better on this run, am I? Like, I thought I was doing better, but then I had one really stupid fail, and then I had this stupid fail. It's like... I feel like I'm just getting worse and worse at this game as the series goes on. Probably because the game gets more difficult as it goes on. So, you know, this is a game, and that's how games work. They're supposed to get more difficult as they progress. Ah! Alright, we win! We win! Now let's go see Mrs. Puff to get our amazing reward. Yeah. Congratulations! You passed with flying colors. Why did the music just stop? I don't know. What happened to the music? I don't know. Well, I guess... <sighs> There's nothing like the smell of bubble I guess we'll just head to the second area. Um, hopefully this music comes back. And the music's back. Yay! Alright, let's see if we can uh, hit this torpedo robot with the bubble bowl. Come on, snipe. Aw, oh, what? Why did it go... Uh, <laughs> and while we do this, I'm so scared of these guys now. I'm like, going to enjoy myself a nice piece of Hershey's dark chocolate. Yeah. All right, Flounder Hill. Here we are at Flounder Hill. This is Hershey's special dark. I fly like the wind and float like a sea bee. If you can beat my time down the hill, I'll give you a golden spatula. I like how they keep those accept time challenge messages like really short. Like they don't have it go on and on and on for like eight minutes before they actually tell you that. They just give you one piece of dialogue. And guess what? I think it's time that I actually play with as Sandy. Because, you know, you can't do the time challenges with SpongeBob. You can only do them with Sandy. So we got a snowman, and then a... You know, in the old days, I didn't like dark chocolate as much. But it's kind of grown on me over time. Yeah. It's got this sort of cocoa-y, cho uh, chalky aftertaste that I like. It also kind of smells like hot chocolate, not cocoa. That's probably because dark chocolate is what they use for the ingredients in hot cocoa, probably. Uh, in some cocos, yes. Um. It's a snowman. Uh, yeah. That's what you gotta do. I guess because I've already hit three of them, I'm gonna go ahead and get the uh, annoying sock over with. That this level has. Because this sock, you have to hit those eight snowmen. And it's like, they're on different paths, so you have to play the slide multiple times. Now usually what I do is I just play Sandy like I'm doing now, and I just go back up the hills. Because with Sandy, because of her gliding ability that can sh she can do with her whip, she can actually go back up hills that you've gone down so you can just pretty much I want to make sure I get this guy yep 
So, you know, I want to make sure that, uh... Yeah, so you can just do it in one run. And, yeah. I know my commentary is just brilliant. <laughs> Be terrible. Boom. You know what would help your commentary? What? A piece of dark chocolate. Give you a little energy boost. Well, I can't eat your candy. Because I, I still have a lot of my own. That I've had from Christmas. But still, I still have about half of. You do, yeah. Yeah. That is very self-disciplined. So I got like nine big candy bars or ten big candy bars. And I still have like four left. I ate the fifth one yesterday. Alright. Okay. Get the golden spatula. Yep. Fifty. Fifty golden spatulas. Yeah. Eh. Alright. So I'm gonna do this slide again and get the other two snowmen. So... And to be fair, I could just do these on the time challenge run, which I probably just should have done. Well, actually, I think there was a jump that I wanted to make that the uh, other snowman is on, but... Um, but I couldn't do it if I was going for all the snowmen, so... Oh, sandmen, I'm sorry. Alright. To be honest, yeah, that sock actually isn't that annoying. I don't know why I said it was really that annoying. Alright, now, up here... There is... Another sock. So, we're about to get two socks in a row. So that's kind of cool, right? I think so. There it is! Uh. Now... We're gonna do Bubble Buddies... Time Challenge. So we got two minutes. Alright. Here we go. Dun dun. -uh. But I guess since we're in a snow level, apparently it's gonna snow tomorrow, maybe. 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 Though I hope it does snow. Just because that'll be cool. You can make your own snowman. Um, I don't. I don't think I'll be able to make a snowman out of the ice that falls down. Because <laughs> it's not really snow; it's more of ice. Make a really small snowman. Um, I remember one time when you were playing this level. We got to this point right here, and then um. You got up to that point right there, and you died. And you were like, oh no, because like, you were struggling to get past the second checkpoint. <laughs> you were almost making it to the third. And you were just struggling so much. And you were about to make it to the next checkpoint, and then you failed. And it was just... It was it was actually quite funny. Um, uh, I do fail often when I play video games. Like Alright. Alright. Oh, are we gonna make it in time? Are we gonna make it in time? 13. Yeah, there we go. Bubble Buddy's impressed with us, I think. Maybe. Congratulations, Bubble 
Congratulations, SpongeBob. You beat my best time. Here's a spatula. Yeah. So let's see. Yep, we've pretty much. We only have one more slide to go, two more spatulas to get, and three more socks to collect. And then we're finished with this level. So next time on SpongeBob SquarePants Battle for Bikini Bottom, did you see that awesome bowling ricochet? Nice. Aha! <laughs> We'll be heading to the third slide. I like the guy's dance moves just here, too. The guy? Yep. Yeah. I like, I, like <laughs> that. I like that move. We'll see you guys next time. Bye, everybody.